Final of the match this afternoon against Bradford Park Avenue. Now, what did you make of the game overall? It was a game of certainly two halves. Yeah, the first half I think we were quite good. Um, obviously, we did well to go three up, which we haven't done much um, since I've been here. But we did well to do that, playing good. And then second half we was um, unfortunate with the sending off. I think it was very. Um, a very like tough decision on him and then obviously we had to just try digging and um, we conceded two early goals which I don't think um, one of them was a pen but it is what it is and we managed to dig in and get the job done. On, on a personal level you seem to be enjoying it you seem to have license to get forward especially in the first half. Um, yeah the gaffer said once a saw play with freedom and expression and uh, we've done well and yeah so it's good to have a gaffer that has faith in you to do, play how you want to play. And it won't be too long, presumably, before you get on the score sheet, you get into the positions, yeah. and it's not quite firing, is I it? Know, hopefully. I had a couple a chance today, had a couple of chances in other games, but I didn't seem to be able to score yet, but hopefully it will come soon. Stop start in the second half, we've talked about the referee already, um, but it was important to get the victory in the end. Um, yeah, it was what we needed. I think now we might be like two points off playoffs or something, that's our aim, to try to get playoffs and... Um, the victory really helped us do that and hopefully we can carry on. And all three clubs that you're playing, Spenny Moore are locked with you, uh, Hereford in the table, and then you've got Brackley and Gateshead looking for the title, so I yeah, think they're really good games for a player to look forward to. Um, yeah, they're good games, uh, tough games, but I have faith in this team. I think we can go on our day and beat anyone in this league, so hopefully we just go there, play well and get the job done. What's, what's the situation with you at Villa? Are you training... Uh, much of the week with them and then twice a week with Hereford. How, how's it working out? Um, yeah, when I'm not at Hereford, I train with Villa, so just to try to keep my fitness up as much as possible. And yeah. So, I mean, is it possible that you might be able to extend a loan into next year, perhaps? Um, maybe. I'm not too sure what's going to happen yet. We'll just have to see. It's all about the next three games then for, for the club and for you, I suppose. To um, yeah. Make a real statement. Yeah, just trying to play as well as I can in the last three games and get the job done yeah because as, as a group you've all seen to been through it since Christmas up and down uh, and almost there but it's that final push that you need now um, yeah we've been a couple of times we've been close to making it into playoff places and then the final push just hasn't been but hopefully this last three games we can fulfill the job and thanks for your time thank you so how have you found sort of your time at Hereford I'm guessing this is the first time you've played consistently play first team football um, yeah this is the first time consistently played it's found it good playing every week so yeah it's been good and what have you sort of learnt from the players around you I'm guessing um, just managing games be playing in the men's game instead of under 23's football like, good experience yeah a lot of different tricks for games management I'm guessing coming uh, to play yeah a couple today yeah <laughs> ok great thank you